Going on to the excerpts, it says, check the key signature. So in this excerpt, we have no sharps and no flats. So that means B naturals and E naturals. Watch out for those. So starting at the beginning, you wanna have a really strong articulation. If I was going to demonstrate this articulation, my if I were playing F uh, without uh, an accent, it would sound like this. And if I were to play Fs with the accent, it would sound like this. And it doesn't necessarily have to be louder. We don't have a starting dynamic for this excerpt, but it goes to forte at 95, so I would assume that it's a little bit less before moving to forte at 95. So playing through it, when you go through from the accent to the staccato, make sure that you're not clipping the staccato notes with a tut 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 at the end of the note. Make sure that you're still letting the note ring out just with a ta 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 ta. Don't stop your air, keep your air moving, just ta 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 ta. Um, and give space between each of those notes. If it helps you to think about it this way, um, when I see a crescendo, I think of backing off a little bit at first. So we're at a forte, da, 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 da. And then I might back off and give myself room to grow with that crescendo again. So, dee da dee da 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 And giving a full quarter note value to that G right before M because that does not have the staccato marking over it. Demonstrating that crescendo one more time. Moving on to the second excerpt, I would say always, um, follow every marking in, a mu in the music for an audition. So there's a breath mark right after B2. We're going to follow that and take a short little breath, even though we just played one note. We're starting fortissimo. We want a nice big sound, but without sounding splatty. And then we're going into staccato. The staccato does not back off in dynamic. You still stay nice and full, but just with a, um, a lighter tongue and space between the notes. So that was at tempo, quarter note equals 120. If you can't play it that fast, that's totally okay right at the beginning. Practice it a little slower and then slowly work it up with that metronome. Having the metronome playing while you play is a great way to keep yourself accountable for not slowing down or speeding up. If you don't have an F attachment, just make sure you're getting all the way out, straightening your arm to those C's in sixth position. Um, you might wanna use a tuner just to check yourself on some of those. The tuner